Hi folks and welcome to another episode of Tableau in Two Minutes. Today we're going to talk through how you can copy and paste calculated fields between two different workbooks uh, and how to troubleshoot them if they have a slightly different data source. Uh, so the first thing that I've done is I've gone ahead and created a workbook based on the Superstore data set. Now I have two different versions of the Superstore data set. Uh, very similar but one has slightly different field names from the other. Uh, that's something I bet you have run into a lot. Maybe you have a field that's called sales in one or unit sales in another or revenue in another. Um, those subtle changes can be a bit of a pain in the backside and sometimes it really does save a lot of time if we're able to copy and paste calculated fields from one workbook to another. Um, so you'll see down here I've created a price per unit calculated field. Uh, in that we have the sum of sales which is the total revenue divided by the sum of quantity uh, which gets us the average price sold per unit uh, and then we've gone ahead and created this very basic visualization here uh, just a bar graph showing the average price per unit for each of these categories. Now, say we wanted to create the same type of visualization or we wanted to use the same information in another dashboard and we had a slightly different version um, of the data set. So let me go ahead and pull that across here. So you can see in this one, we have a uh, very similar data set, similar information. We also have sales. Uh, we don't have quantity, we have order quantity instead. Um, we haven't already calculated item for unit price, but unfortunately that unit price is um, calculated in the database, so it's not gonna be accurate when we sum it up. Um, so let's go ahead and move that calculator field across. The first thing we wanna go, just go back to our old data source, right click, click on the right field, then click copy, go back over to our other database, go ahead and click in here, and click paste. You'll see it comes across, but it comes across with this red exclamation point because we have order quantity in here instead of quantity. What we can do is we can go ahead and edit it. You'll see the quantity is grayed out. So we just want to delete that, replace with order quantity. And then if we drag that out onto our rows shelf here, product subcategory, and then we sort this you'll see we have basically the same visualization in both data sets using the same calculation. And we were able to just copy and paste it across instead of um, bringing it, or instead of having to type it in manually um, or to copy and paste the individual formula. Uh, now, that's really helpful if you happen to have a field that has a lot of complicated logic in it, or you have a particular calculation that uh, is just has uh, one of those big nested if statements or a bunch of parentheses all over the place that's really hard to replicate. Uh, so that's it for this episode of Tableau in Two Minutes. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like what you see, then please subscribe to our channel. And as always, we have a link to the data set, in this case, data sets, um, and the workbook in the video description.